Who have we got here? Oh, my name's Mark Hoyle from Mark? Cambridge. Mark Hoyle from Cambridge. And what have you got here, Mark? I've got my ornithopter. Your ornithopter. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And can we have a look at it? Of course show us, show us the bits and pieces here. It's quite an interesting looking model. Okay. There we go. There's okay. Not so much to it. No. And it, it's got flaps and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Since I'll put some power on and show you if you like. Pretty simple. Usual motor controller here. That just controls the motor for the for the uh, flapping. Oh, okay, so what's wrong here now? Oh, I know what it is. There we go. Put a bit of throttle on there. So that's ready to go. So what you've got here is you've got your your rudder control there. Yeah, that's the back there. Yeah, that just tilts and. You've got your elevator. Excellent. And that's it. And then well, that just makes it drop me down. This... Like that. Some cams and gears and things. And, yeah. and then after that, quartz speed. Yeah, sweet. And then I've got it set, so it's got a couple of different glide angles as well. Yeah. Um, that's it. It's a sort of a work in progress, really. Excellent. It flies okay, but I will be changing things. It'd be nice eventually to enclose all this and just. <laughs> Make well, it look like the real thing a bit, you know? Well, we'll watch it fly then. Okay. <laughs> Very much like an aggressive walk. Beautiful, mate. And here we have a couple of swallows. We have, all the birds are starting to gang up on this thing now. You see it as an aggressive. A truly amazing flying machine. Something that shouldn't fly. Glide. More of a pool, really. More birds ch chasing it around. Look at that. Swallows. And here it comes on its descent. Beautiful. There is the ornithopter, an amazing machine. And how much did it cost you to build this? Uh, around about five, six hundred dollars. That's New Zealand like. dollars, which is. Yeah, New Zealand, yeah. yeah, yeah. Which is. Um, Nearly five or six hundred American because the American dollar's taking a big dive. Well, yeah, no, I mean, I well, I've had it a few months now, so you know, once mm. I started buying the parts, I suppose I think you're sort of talking four hundred. Yeah, US. so this is like about ten dollars Australian now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's true. Yeah. yeah, yep. So, like I say, but I mean, a lot of the stuff obviously came from here. It was just some of the bits I had to get from the states, and yeah, uh, and just a regular four-channel radio. Uh huh. Well, this, this is a six, but you only need yeah. four, yeah. really. That's the thing. So it was just that bits that I some of the bits I already had and things like that. So. Oh. But yeah, the idea, work in progress, different tails, different wing loadings and stuff like that, and different shapes really, that's what I want to, you know, work with. I know some of the guys that have built these have, you know, they make them much smaller and much faster and use them for, you know, chasing after birds and stuff yeah. like that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thanks very much. Okay, you're welcome, thank you.